Hey folks, this is Helcorex here. Just doing an update. Uh, it's been a while. Uh, I've been uh, out of town. Yeah, you know, we had some family problems. My uh, father was in the hospital, so I was out of town dealing with that. And uh, doing much better. And then I had a really bad cold. I think you probably heard some of the sniffling last time, but it got to the point where I couldn't even breathe. Felt like uh, somebody put a couple of balloons in my head and then swelled them up and exploded. But uh, as you can see, uh, I did an update the last time when I was talking about the Catan um, Demon Engine of Corn and how I picked it up and I was gonna get, I think I was gonna get started on it. And so what you see is the end result of all the work, but you never seen anything in between. It was just one of those things where in between running around, going out of town, back home, back out of town, and everything, I just never had time to do an update. You just now suddenly jumping forward to the uh, final product. And uh, um, I did mention what the plan was for it was I laid down a base of uh, uh, P3 brass uh, what is that um, let's see molten bronze then I <coughs> agrax or shade over it and then uh, dry brushed a little bit of uh, Gana's gold and then uh, I uh, put a wash over that and you have the metallics then I uh, put the corn red down then the Mephiston red and then there was uh, Scar Evil Sun Scarlet with a bit of Troll Slayer to give it kind of an orange flavor to the whole model so it kind of brightens it up a little bit as you can see here you turn I got them um, at the base here of the waist I got it pinned so if it's easier to when I want to travel with it I can uh, break it down into two pieces so now it rotates pretty good we'll flip around here so you can see the back side I uh, went with since it was all the warm colors with a little bit of steel uh, coloration for the breaking everything up I went with some uh, um, green uh, necrotic flesh I think it is let's check here from p3 necrotite green from p3 that's what I put in there and just to because they have all these cables and it looks like it's uh, kind of a fleshy cabling system from the demon engine itself so I put kind of a flesh tones on those kind of like it's using human flesh or something animal flesh and uh, making the pipes and I had the like an ectoplasmic green ooze coming out of the uh, all the flesh areas but uh, yep that's all everything on it and then we got the uh, next project coming up here we got probably I don't know if I showed you this. It's coming in the pipeline here. Let's move this down a little bit. And what we have is the, uh, it's another Serastis Knight. I started, just pulled it out. So this is going to be my night project again. Um, so that's it for that. And uh, just start putting that together, and I'll probably do another update showing all the progress with that. But that's just a quick update of what's going on around here, and uh, maybe I can get some photos of it, and we'll put those up. And uh, you guys have a good one. This is Hulk Rex. Hulk Rex out.